Hello everybody, this is Margaret with Alabama Prepper. Hope everybody's having a good day. Uh, it's nice here today, 65 degrees. We're having cold nights. We did get some rain yesterday and it's supposed to get some more Tuesday night. So maybe good Lord willing that will help to bring up uh, some of our lakes and our creeks. Had to go buy groceries today. I was out of a lot of stuff. The daughter-in-law from Niceville came in and took me to uh, buy groceries. I have never seen so many online blue carts at Walmart as I did today. It was unreal. They were lined up and the aisles next to the groceries, there was only w one little old bitty spot to go back and forth. Everybody was just really getting aggravated because they, they could not maneuver around them. This is, uh, if you're not familiar with it, it's the online ordering for Walmart. Now, in our area, the flu has come back in. There are some COVID cases that's come back in mostly flu and mostly what they're calling adult RSV um, and people are not wanting to get out and get in the public. I wipe my cart down when I go in. I wipe my cart down with their sanitizer uh, little sheets, uh, wash my hands real good, but the store was full and I'm, I'm just, like I said, I've never seen so many of the on, blue online carts or buggies that there was at Walmart today. Walmart was full. I mean, lots and lots of people. Uh, got behind two today that their cards would not work. Um, don't know what the problem was, but... You know, they, they, I don't know how many times they go through them to see if their cards will work, but they've all had groceries. But it's really sad. I don't know the reason why their cards won't work, but anyhow, they couldn't get their cards to work. Groceries had doubled. Everything had, it, it, it's just unreal. One of the rotisserie chickens at Walmart, I've been given seven ninety for the rotisserie chicken. I wanted one for the grand, great grandbaby because he was coming this afternoon, and I had to give nine ninety for a rotisserie chicken. That was unreal. That's a three dollar increase, you know, of the rotisserie. I think I spent fifty seven dollars at one grocery store. I bought uh, pork, pork steaks, some potatoes, some cucumbers. Um, maybe one pack of cube steak. And I think that was about it at that store. It was $57. Went over to Walmart, got the basics like uh, washing powders. I bought used detergent, milk, uh, cheese, paper towels, um, you know, just basic things that you got to have to live on day by day. About two packs of ground chuck, which was nine ninety seven. They had it on sale. Two pound, two and a half pound pack, I believe, it was like nine ninety seven. About two packs of those. But they have, a, they offer two hens to a bag. If you buy them in the bag, you get them cheaper than you get them if you buy them separate. You know the. So I bought two of those, which was $12 and some. Bought a uh, pack of bacon and a pack of sausage. That's all the meat I had. Bought some cereal. Uh, brought, bought bread, bought coffee. Anyhow, $257 whenever I checked out of Walmart. It's just sad, just sad. Everything has just gone up so high. But anyhow, I think it's just going to get worse. We've got to be more, um, 
I, I don't know how you would say it. We're going to have to really watch our budget and put that. I, my, my pantry's running really, really low because I have used so much out of it and I have not put uh, food back in it. So hopefully before long I can start uh, canning and get some more jars put up in the uh, pantry. That's what I'm hoping for. But anyhow, thank you so much for watching my channel. Thank you for all my subscribers. Thank you for all my new subscribers. Uh, we're going to get better, good Lord willing. Uh, this is not me not being able to work and do around. So, you know, just praying that, you know, in a couple of weeks, maybe I'll be back to normal. Thank you so much for watching my channel, and you do have a blessed day.